my friends, this is Andy Vegan on my gentle juice fasting day I do once a week. It's nice, really it feels, it feels so relieved. I can let go what I don't need. My, my body um, does not need to digest anything uh, because I only drink juices, fresh pressed juices. And these juices go directly with their nutrients into the system. So I don't need 60% of the energy from the food for the digester don't need this energy. It directly goes directly everything in the system for me to use, to cleanse, uh, to be creative, to meditate, all these things. Very helpful every day. So I tune into the right direction. Yeah. There is always if you don't do that, if I don't do that, there's always a small deviation. I don't notice. Yeah, the subconsciousness is very big. A very large part of our of our consciousness is subconscious and um, it directs where we are going, where we are heading to. That's a modern psychological theory. Of course, it is not accepted by everyone, but it makes sense for, a certain, for certain things to explain. And it's good to understand that we don't, uh, are not fully free to decide what we do and we don't know everything we do. Yeah. A lot of things we don't know. So to get more awareness of these hidden parts, uh, fasting is helpful. To me it helps, it helps a lot, big deal. And over a long time, you, gentle juice fasting is very easy, everybody can do it. Just drinking juices, or only a juices a day in the week, well, nobody is harmed by that. You don't even see a doctor for that. The juices are nutrient dense, fresh, and once a week, no harm is done. Never, definitely not. So very easy, and you can also, if you feel bad and nauseous or headache or something, just eat a little fruit or take a little soup, a light soup or a light salad. No problem. There is no stress. Most important is it's gentle. That means you feel great. As long as you feel great, everything is good. That's the idea of gentle use fasting. Feeling great, and on the long, run, on the long run, you will win. Yeah? Everybody can do it, so that's the best method to me, most effective, as it works on the long term. So imagine if you one day a week, you fast only one day a week, in seven years, you have done one full year fasting. Isn't that amazing? You won't lose weight by fasting. It's not for losing weight, it's just for these internal processes, yeah? To self-reflection, to cleanse out everything, to purify the body and the mind, let go of what you don't need, and to be creative, more sensitive, yeah? All these kind of things are nice, isn't it? <laughs> so now I will show you what kind of juice I will make today. And it's green juice based on orange juice. You know, broccoli is a little bit hard to juice and to eat raw, but you can also uh, take a small quantity of broccoli. Here you see I use every part of the broccoli, uh, not only the florets, so the gen most gentle ones, also everything here, but not that much. Most of the parties here, the orange. I have two large oranges, only a quarter of a medium broccoli head. See, two large oranges, ripe, sweet, juicy, peeled, of course, wouldn't be too, wouldn't be too bitter. If I use the peel here, that would be definitely too bitter. All the bitterness already in the broccoli. I don't need any more for now, for the beginning. Yeah. And I want large lemon. Lemon is in general very good for green, leafy greens or for greens in general. Jeans, uh, greens can be a little bit bitter and lemon is a very good to balance this kind of bitterness. It's also good if I mean, most of the greens, there are some oxalates, some acids that keep the body from, from taking up nutrients and also leave some debris in the system. For example, kidney stones can come from oxalates. In broccoli, there's not so much, but a little bit is, and a lemon. If you have a problem with oxalates, use lemon a lot, because the lemon cleanses out everything until you prevent the kidney stones. Yeah? That's a gel better stones too, yeah. Lemon is very good for that. So I always have lemon at home, one of my most important um, 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 veggies at home. Lemon is always there. So I begin juicing, yeah? orange, broccoli, lemon. Very easy. I come back in. <laughs> Juiced everything, and as you can see, there's not so much, not too much of the crester left over that can go into the garden. To do, just dig it in the earth, and the plants will be happy to grow. I don't know any better, any better fertilizer than just the the crester from the juicing. Yeah, it's nice. And you don't need to do anything; just dig it, 
thoroughly. And if you just want to go out of every time you add some juice, you can put it into a plastic bag and put it under the cupboard as I do it. And I collect the plastic, uh, the, uh, the, the, the rest of the plastic bag for a month or so, yeah, uh, even longer, uh, until it gets um, a little bit um, wet, the plastic bag. Then you know it's time to get out into the garden just to collect it and to save some time. No, not because it has to ripen or mature or something. No, no, you can put it right where in the garden. And it's uh, very, very good for the plants. Yeah, so um, let's taste it. It's uh, slightly green, the juice, more yellowish, because I only use uh, not too much um, broccoli. It would, wouldn't taste so good. Uh, this is uh, not so easy, but if you have plenty of fruit, like an orange here, sour fruit, sweet sour fruit, uh, then it might be good. Let's taste it. Just like combine everything evenly. Now I take my spoonful. Yeah, nice. Yeah, that's the general. In general, uh, with the, um, these um, veggies, it's cruciferous, cruciferous veggies like cauliflower, broccoli, or so, chard, uh, oranges, and citrus fruit are very good. Apples too can be very nice with that. Well, I show you what it looks like. And you have these wonderful health benefits. Cruciferous veggies are very healthy especially uh, even cancer preventing. So we should always get your broccoli in, if you can. And there are many ways to do that in an efficient way, in a nice way. See, my juice today. I hope you enjoy. Um, and if you want to join a gentle juice fasting group, we have one on Facebook. It's called Tree Yoga Moon Fasting. You can get there and apply for membership. Very easy. And every day, every week, I post one new recipe, you have a fasting calendar, one of the best days, or the moon, moon days even, are there, but you can do it just every day, every week, one day, um, and uh, feel fine. Hope to see you soon. I can also subscribe to Andrew Vegan on YouTube, have another recipe every single day. You can go to Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, and Twitter, and find Andrew Vegan. See you there.